So this is how you wind back a Volkswagen Passat <laughs> rear calipers. And this is how it happened. Check it out. Wait, did you take it off? Yeah. Okay, there it is. Yeah, so anyways, on this one, so we're able to get that piece on like so. Like this. Now, it's going to go in with those two teeth. That way, uh, I can find it in the dough. Yeah, because the way they give it, give you the tool it makes no sense on how it's supposed to work. So anyways, those two grooves go in there. Okay, so now the way this works is that this, the shaft has to be turned in and then the ratchet has to be turned out. Like so, tighten up the ratchet. Hold on. This way, yep, towards me. And then now, stop. And then turn the shaft clockwise. That way, this way. Yep, there you go. Now tighten up the ratchet. It's 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 a process. Okay, good. Hold it. Yep. That allows it to go back in there. Now tighten it up so it presses again and gives it some pressure. Good. Jesus piece of shit. <laughs> <laughs> What a process, eh? I wish I was a monkey right now. I had four, four hands. I know. Get this job done real quick. Yeah, a lot easier with three hands now. <laughs> How'd you have four? <laughs> Talk about evolution bullshit. <laughs> okay, good. Now turn it. Try to see if it's, that's the maximum. I think that's as far as it goes. Yep, and that's it. Now loosen it up a bit. Let's take it out. Yep. Voila. Yeah, there you go. Give me the other piece. Beautiful. Now. So, brakes are all preset. Put the uh, caliper bracket back on. And then do the rest. And that's how you wind back the rear calipers on the 2012 Volkswagen Passat. Peace.